Matt Cowan back at the round table, continuing our NBA stat previews today, showing how these three numbers will tell the story of the 2018-19 Detroit Pistons. The Pistons won 60% of the 43 games that Reggie Jackson played in last season, such as over an entire season, and that will leave the Pistons with approximately 49 wins. A 49-33 record would have been good for 5th in the East last year. Add a full season of Blake Griffin on top of a full season of Jackson, and this win total may not be that far off. Griffin and Jackson played four games together last year, and the Jackson-Griffin duo spent just 47 minutes on the court together, so there's not much to gauge from that. However, the Pistons did go three in one of these four games, and the Jackson-Griffin combo did post an impressive 11.9 net rating on the four together. Of course, the sample size is pretty limited, but it is something to think about and reason to be optimistic if they do manage to play a full season together next year. Andre Drummond led the league last year with 5.7 defensive win shares. He's led the league in defensive rating each of the last two years as well. Last season, he edged out defensive stalwarts Rudy Gobert, Joel Embiid, and Clint Capella, who finished 2, 3, and 4, respectively. He has led the league in total rebounding percentage three of the six years he's been in the league, and his 10.3 win shares last year was 10th in the league. Having turned 25 this offseason, he is just entering his prime now. Drummond has been one of the most underappreciated players in the league, with just one All-NBA team appearance, which came in the 15-16 season as a third-team All-NBA player. The lack of team success may be a contributor to this. However, this season, the Pistons seem primed to be a playoff team, and Drummond will be a big part of that, and he should start to receive proper recognition for his accomplishments. There really aren't any proven NBA wings on this roster. There are some intriguing pieces. It'll be year two of Luke Kennard, who shot well in his rookie year. Reggie Bullock is a decent offensive player and shooter, but not much else. Stanley Johnson defends well, but still did not show much offensively in year three. Glenn Robinson has shown some flashes, but has not put together a full season of productive basketball in four years as an NBA player. Dwayne Casey will certainly have his work cut out for him in getting production from these wing players. This team is built to win now with a 28-year-old Reggie Jackson, 25-year-old Andre Drummond, and 29-year-old Blake Griffin, but it does not seem there is enough on the wing to have a chance at a playoff run. That's going to be it from the roundtable. Check out the full NBA Team Previews playlist. And if you like those, consider subscribing. More videos on the way every day in September for all 30 teams, every 2 p.m. on weekdays and 9 a.m. on weekends. Thank you very much for watching.